all my niggas who didn't grow up on the East Coast and my single moms who might be in the market to buy a little man man a fresh pair of butters for the upcoming winter, let me let you know this is the only acceptable version of the construction Tims you should ever be buying. There's a lot of phonies out there, but these are the only ones that's legit. You see the leather around the ankle and not one but two soles. Classic. This is it. Stay away from those other ones. These is the, I can't believe they're not butters, margins if you will. They try to fool you with the leather up top, but it only got one sole. I remember seeing these. I didn't, they didn't have these back in the day. <clears throat> they had the single sole in that, and, and the back piece wasn't there. <clears throat> I think they just started making those recently, because um, the ones, I remember the ones they had back in the day, they, we didn't have, they didn't have the um, the back piece, and it was cheaper. Let's leave these the construction workers and niggas who work for the water authority. That's it. We call these the butt naked. Oh, no yeah. leather up top, one sole. These are sexual offender boots. The only niggas who wow. should be wearing these is locked up during state time. That's it. I remember, um, yeah, we had, a lot of people had those, though. Because I remember, um, matter of fact, I got the, um, it's those, but it's the uh, eight inch. The high, like the old uh, Dallas effects in them they used to be wearing, them old ones, um, without the back piece. But um, those are always cheaper because I think Tim's are like two hundred and some dollars now. But back then, um, like the single sole was how much was the single sole? Yeah, the single sole was like ninety bucks or hundred dollars. Now it's just much as the um the, the double sole with, with with the back leather. So it's it's like damn. Never for fashion. Please don't try to cut corners. Oh, those are low. Instead of the original ones, I know you get double soles of wool leather up top. Those are chucks. It's like an eighth of an inch of leather. Nah, niggas pull up your pant legs and see these, you might get suplexed. Stay away from these. These are super duper nasty. I'm going to tell you right now, Same these thing. are worse than the high top butt naked joints. And I swear to God, the I go with lowercase Tim's and this is what came up. Do with that information what you will, but don't buy these. Nah, bro. Oh, no, 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 no. I remember, though. The soul not Hold on, let me get, let me get that back. Hold I, on. Nah, bro. Don't buy these. I remember when these <clears throat> first came out in, um, let's see, 99 or early 2000s. I was like, what the hell kind of, I'm about to Timberland look like it's made with a sock on it. That's what it looked like. I was like, what is, I think they're called a roll top boot. I was like, I don't, I don't know, I, I, I'm not a fan crazy about that. Only way I picked them up is if they was about thirty dollars. I then I probably picked those up. But yeah, that, I, then I said, well, I, I said, what the hell kind of Tims are those when those <clears throat> when those first came out? I said, eh. I pick up the the, uh, the single sole before I picked that up. The uh, the Timberlands uh, with, with the sock <clears throat> with the sock cuff. Know about that? Nah, bro. Short sleeve Timberlands, tank top Timberlands. Short sleeve. The sole not even the right color. I never seen Tim's you could cuff. What material was that? Get these Burlington Co Factory boots the fuck out of here. These is a dub. Don't ever buy them. Oh shit. That was something, boy. He <laughs> said, "Get these Burlington Co Factory." Oh, but they and, and, but they're still like a hundred bucks though. If it's half the shoe, it should be half the price. Cause, damn. <clears throat> I remember um I had the double sole, the single sole, and then of course you have the um it looked like they had so many some back then I remember in the nineties they had so many shoes that looked like Tim's. It was sickening. They had um which I got a pair right now because you know like I said they're cheaper, the mountain gears. They got the Fubus that look like Tim's. They got the um not the Fubu or um lugs. Um Another type of boot. Um, you know, like I said, it's crazy. Like, um, you need like a good, strong boot, like you said, for working or something. Yeah, but um, like 200 and something bucks for a pair of shoes just to roll in the dirt. Unless, like you said, use them for like um, for actual work or something. But like, yeah, like. Just shoe with this them or the Jordans, like oh, another dude. Just I, I mean that's that's up to him. But two hundred bucks just to get the shoe to roll in, roll in the dirt. That's <laughs> crap. So I was like, I don't know about uh, rolling the good Jordans in the dirt. I remember the one dude who used to fix the shoes. Um, 
his channel still, but I don't think he's on YouTube anymore. But he used to um clean the shoe, um well the, the shoe looks like it's ready for the garbage. But he um bring them back with the, whatever whatever that cleaner was he used. <clears throat> but yeah, um I done had the um two of those and then the um the Chucks um basically the one I got now there um mountain gear but like shit like a like a little piece of a little piece of leather with their cheek because I said mm. them shit's done going up. Remember they was like um one twenty. Then I heard he went to one fifty. Now they're like two hundred I said, Oh no, that's Joy, you I could get a <clears throat> bunch of decent shoes for a uh, 150 shoe. That's like, that's crisis. <clears throat> I'm crazy. Mm. I and mean, this might have been before inflation, so I can't, can't you can't say it's inflation, but yeah, that's <clears throat> price is high, high as a damn ceiling. 